Hi, my name is Terry Martin. I'm the Props Master for Idaho Shakespeare Festival and Great Lakes Theater Festival. We are backstage of Ideal Husband, uh, our current show running here. Uh, it will be transferring to Cleveland uh, this coming fall. Um, we are going to walk backstage, check out the props tables, the furniture, and all the other things we've created for this show. Well, back here we're setting up the prop tables. Uh, there's a prop table stage left and stage right. Uh, each prop table is labeled with exactly what goes on it. Um, the actor comes, takes their prop from its spot, uses it on stage, it then comes off stage and goes back exactly on the table where it started. Uh, the number of props in this show, uh, all told, just probably 6, 60 to 80, somewhere in there. There's probably about 3 to 4 personal props per character, uh, and I think we have roughly 8 to 10 yeah. Uh, the play is actually um, set in 1895, so we're right at the turn of the century. All of the uh, props are extremely period specific. Uh, we've actually printed period newspapers, um, period lighters, which are flint lighters, uh, the precursors to Zippos, um, all period glassware, period silver. Ideal Husband opens uh, with a party scene. Um, one thing that uh, we have problems with in Idaho is the wind. Uh, we are an outdoor theater. Uh, so we were a little worried about the uh, waiters with all the champagne glasses. So we actually attach magnets onto the bottom of the champagne glass, which keeps them nice and solid on the tray. We can tilt a little bit here and there, and they don't come off. That's the magnetic champagne glasses. We also smoke an ideal husband, uh, but we don't actually smoke cigarettes. We found a fantastic product online. It's an electronic cigarette. It's metal. It has a plastic filter that uh, contains water, absolutely no nicotine, no chemicals. The actors will hit it, it lights up, and they can blow out water vapor, which looks like smoke. And there's our fake cigarette. So one thing you'll notice uh, with Ideal Husband when you see the show is that the set is extremely simple um, and the furniture of the set pretty much compiles about a third of the set design. So we had to be very specific with the furniture. We went with Louis XIV. So we've upholstered the chairs in white and then watercolored actually straight onto the fabric which blends into the colors that we've used on the set. Then we've also taken a gold and silver patina uh, and put a coat of patina on the chairs to give them a little bit of sparkle and pizzazz. For this production, uh, there are a total of eight chairs, four armchairs and four side chairs. Uh, the chairs were first uh, reupholstered. The reupholstery and trim took roughly two to three days in total. And uh, the patina, which was the paint technique on the chairs. The patina took a total of three days. My favorite part of uh, the process of the prop master's job is getting into tech and really making it all come together. Finalizing all the props, finding all the last little uh, last minute pieces and accoutrements, and the set dressing, which was adding all of the trim and patina on the chairs and polishing the silver and basically getting everything just gorgeous and ready for opening night. Right now, I'm about to go get strawberries for the show because we've run out uh, and I have 45 minutes to procure a bunch of strawberries that we need for the opening party scene. <laughs>